South Korea's National Security Council, or NSC, called on North Korea today to faithfully implement agreements for denuclearization and peace reached at the recent inter-Korean summit. The statement comes one day after the Communist state abruptly called off a high level meeting largely aimed at discussing ways to implement the summit agreements. South Korean presidential office Chung Ade said members of the NSC Standing Committee discussed future steps in regard to North Korea's decision to postpone the high-level South-North dialogue, which was originally scheduled for May 16, while reaffirming their stance that the Panmunjom Declaration reached at 2018 Inter-Korean Summit must be carried out without any disruption, the members agreed to continue consulting with North side to hold the high-level talks at an early date. The NSC meeting, chaired by Jung Yong, the top security adviser to President Moon Jae-in, was held earlier in the morning. Panmunjom is a small border village inside a heavily fortified demilitarized zone that divides the two Koreas, where Moon held his first ever meeting with North Korean leader Kim Jong-un on April 27. In the historic summit, the leaders of the divided Koreas agreed to pursue complete denuclearization of the Korean Peninsula and to halt their country's hostile acts against each other. The North Korean leader is now set to meet with U.S. President Donald Trump to discuss on what terms his country will give up its nuclear ambitions. The South Korean NSC members vowed their support for the U.S.-North Korea summit. The standing committee members decided to closely coordinate the country's positions through various channels between South Korea and the U.S. and the South and the North, so the upcoming North Korea-U.S. summit will be held successfully under the spirit of mutual respect, Chung Wat said in a press release. The Trump-Kim meeting is scheduled to be held in Singapore on June 12th. It will mark the first U.S.-North Korea summit in history. I'm Ju Wan Chung, Yanam News.